So I'm sure everyone wants to know, what mm -hmm. is your skincare protocol? So talk us through in some detail what Carolina does for skincare uh, from the time you wake up till the time you go to sleep. Yeah, luckily it's very simple. So uh, in the morning, because my skin is already clean from the day, from the night before, I just rinse my face. Uh, I I usually go to the gym. It's still like you know early on, and when I come back, I, I shower and then I apply the uh, face uh, moisturizer. I apply the body lotion after a shower. I apply the eye cream and the honestly, I mostly apply the eye cream at night, but uh, and then I apply the sunscreen. So morning is usually face, body, and the eye cream and the sunscreen. Uh, and then at night, I will wash my face with the cleanser because that's when you need to remove all the impurities, all the, you know, pollution, dirt, really, really important. And, to... and you formulated a cleanser specifically for the product or is any cleanser? Yeah, that... so this cleanser is formulated to first like uh, deeply cleanse your skin, uh, help the peptide to penetrate better. So we have data showing that using the cleanser, you more than double the penetration of the peptide. Uh, also doesn't disrupt your skin microbiome, doesn't dry out your skin. So it's a very gentle cleanser. Uh, some people like to dub double cleanse, like cleanse twice. I, I don't do that. Um, and then at night I apply again the face moisturizer and the eye cream. So pretty simple. Um, takes me less than five minutes. <laughs> but I think other things that you know helped me to improve my skin it was a lot of like really be more mindful of the other products that I was using mainly like makeup a lot of times makeup has a lot of like <clears throat> bad ingredients toxic ingredients so i did reduce a lot of the foundation and then right right now i really look for clean products or products that don't have toxic ingredients because you can try to nurture your skin and if you apply you know other things on top that are not good in the end that you are we're gonna cause some issues there uh other than skincare which is kind of very simple uh i i obviously you know try to get good sleep uh, drink a lot of water and how important is hydration to good skin it's it's very important obviously a lot of the plumpness of the skin the supple comes from the hydration and the hydration one is like the hyaluronic acid or the other uh, extracellular matrix that hold water inside but also your skin barrier, how intact, how strong is your skin barrier to not allow the water loss. So in our clinical studies, one of the main things that we measure is the skin barrier, the ability of to retain moisture or to prevent water loss. And we always see improvement with any product that we develop in the skin barrier. Um, so both, you know, intake of water, but also delivering some ingredients that will help your skin to produce more hyaluronic acid and retain water, super important. And you notice that if you sleep bad or if you drink alcohol, your skin will be completely like uh, affected by that. 